Beethoven, for us, that is the world that we come from. We were conservatory trained. We grew up playing classical music. And we actually have never played a Beethoven quartet as Brooklyn Rider. I pushed it really hard. I wanted to play a Beethoven quartet. I never got any pushback. Uh, everyone wanted to do one. In thinking about which quartet to play, the verdict is still out, but, but many people would say that 131 is, is probably the greatest. And we just wanted to go for the best. I've always thought of Beethoven as one of the composers in the classical canon who is constantly new. And I think that's kind of the journey that we're on with this Beethoven, you know, making sense in, in the Brooklyn Rider view and really trying to relate it to our audience in the 21st century. We want to communicate that this piece, written 200 years ago, is as valid and as real and now as anything else. I think that might have been our best take. Yeah, yeah. Kind of it was the only one where I actually got... Which is what I supposedly have, but off of my... Because it's just like really hard to figure that out. At the time that Beethoven wrote Opus 131, it was considered fiendishly difficult um, when told by the players of the quartet that first played it that it was really difficult. He said, well, I'm not writing this for you. I'm writing this for, for the future. You know, someday people get this stuff. <laughs> so we're still trying to figure it out. <laughs> ¶¶